Princess Summit. You must be over the moon, Twilight. Oh, I am excited. But to be honest, I'm a little nervous too. You're nervous excited! It's like you want to jump up and down and yell, yay, me! But you also want to curl up in a teeny tiny ball and hide at the same time! <laughs> there almost every day. You got no reason to fret, Twy. Everything's gonna be just... Twilight! Oh, sorry, darling. But I just realized you're not wearing your crown. You haven't forgotten it back in Ponyville, have you? It's in my bag. Just feel a little self-conscious about wearing it. Haven't really gotten accustomed to these yet, either. You are a princess now, Twilight. Embrace it. I'm telling you, if I had a crown like that, I would never take it off. Why, I'd sleep in the thing. Her Highness, Princess Twilight Sparkle. <laughs> Twilight! I haven't seen you since the coronation. We have so much to discuss, but it can wait until tomorrow. You all look tired from your journey. Now off to bed, all of you. What's wrong, Twilight? I don't know, Spike. I'm just worried, I guess. Princess Cadence was given the Crystal Empire to rule over. What if now that I'm a princess, Celestia expects me to lead a kingdom of my own? That would be awesome! No, it would not! Just because I have this crown and these wings, it doesn't mean I'll be a good leader. Nah, sure you will, Twilight. But come on, you should get some shut-eye. Big day tomorrow. <sighs>
it. <sighs> my crown! She's got my crown! Stop! Thief! She's stolen my crown! Stop! had to be this way. Princess. <gasps> Who is that? Sunset Shimmer, a former student of mine. She began her studies with me not long before Twilight. But when she did not get what she wanted as quickly as she liked, she turned cruel and dishonest. I tried to help her, but she eventually decided to abandon her studies and pursue her own path. One that has sadly led her to stealing your crown. She replaced Twilight with this one. I suppose Sunset Shimmer thought you wouldn't notice right away that this was not yours. And by the time you did, it would be too late to go after your crown and element of harmony. But I don't understand. Where did she go? Where did she take the crown? You'll soon know more about this place than even I do. This is no ordinary mirror. It is a gateway to another world. A gateway that opens once every 30 moons. Sparkly! It has always been kept in the throne room of Canterlot Castle. But when Princess Cadence took over the Crystal Empire, we sent it here for her to watch over. I had always hoped that Sunset Shimmer would someday use it to return, to come back to Equestria seeking my guidance. Obviously, this is not what has happened. Twilight. You must use the mirror to go into this other world and retrieve your crown. Without it, the other elements of Harmony have no power and Equestria is left without one of its most important means of defense. Your crown does not belong in the place Sunset Shimmer now calls home. And in her possession, your element of Harmony will no doubt be used to bring harm to the inhabitants of this other realm. They will not have the power to defend themselves. You understand the importance of your task? Of course. Good. Then you must go at once. <sighs> whoa, whoa, whoa! She's going? We're going with her. Right, girls? Ooh, I'm so nervous I You do realize that's not a real word, right? I'm afraid I can't let you go. What? Why not? Sending all of you could upset the balance of this alternate world, creating havoc that would make it impossible for Twilight to get the crown back from Sunset Shimmer. This is something Princess Twilight must do alone. Time is of the essence. On the third day, when the moon reaches its peak in the night sky, the gateway will close. And once it does, it will be another 30 moons before you will be able to use it to return. It's all right, all right Twilight. Twilight. You'll, you'll be back right. before you'll you know it. Great. Twilight? Huh? Spike? You're not supposed to... Spike? Are you a dog? I think so. But I have no idea what you are. Huh? Get it together! <sighs> what does the rest of me look like? Um, like you, only not you. Your muzzle's really small. My muzzle? <gasps> Are you gonna scream again? Where? Serve as the gateway back to Equestria. 
We need to find my crown as soon as possible and get back there. I suggest we start searching the castle first. Works for me. Yeah, I don't think that's how the new you is supposed to be. You don't have those pesky wings to worry about anymore. Hmm. My magic! It isn't working! Makes sense. You don't exactly have your horn. What?! We really need to find you a mirror. What do you think, Spike? Other artifacts she's stolen from Equestria? <gasps> what am I? Huh? Whoa! You okay? I've never seen a place that's quiet like this. Everything is turned around. This crazy world is upside down. Getting on my feet, it's the hand that I was dealt. But I don't have much time with them. Got to learn all that I can. Well, I did, and I was about to get it before you swooped in and ruined everything. You shouldn't pick up things that don't belong to you. It, it doesn't really belong to you either. Excuse me? <laughs> Nothing. That's what I thought. It's as good as mine, and you know it. You really are pathetic. It's no wonder your best friends are all stray animals. How dare you speak to her that way? What did you say? I said... How dare you speak to her that way? You must be new here. I can speak to anyone any way I want. I can't believe you did that. I couldn't just stand there. Well, it's just that nobody ever stands up to Sunset Shimmer. Sunset Shimmer? You've heard of her? Sort of. I don't think I've seen you around before. Did you just transfer to Canterlot High from another school? Um, yes. Another <laughs> school. My name's Twilight. I'm Fluttershy. Sorry, what was that? It's Fluttershy. It sounds like you're saying Fluttershy, but how can that... Oh my goodness! Who's this sweet little guy? That's Spike. My, uh, dog. Oh, he's so cute. Go on, eat up, little pup. Oh, wouldn't you just give anything to know?
know what they're really thinking? He usually just tells me. Oh, wh what do you mean? <laughs> oh, uh, nothing. <laughs> Never mind. Sunset Shimmer said you picked something up. Something that belonged to her. It wasn't a crown, was it? How did you know? Uh, lucky guess? <laughs> do you still have it? Mm -mm. But you know what happened to it. Mm-hmm. This morning, I was passing out flyers for the animal shelter like I do every Wednesday. Canterlot's animal shelter needs more volunteers. Won't you help an animal that can't help itself? Ow! I have no idea how it got there, but I didn't want anything to happen to it, so I decided to give it to Principal Celestia. Principal Celestia? She's the ruler here? You could say that. Technically, I guess she and Vice Principal Luna do make the rules. Where is she now? Probably in her office. Third door on your left. Thank you. Oh, wait. You're not really supposed to have pets on school grounds. Might want to tuck them into your backpack. That's what I do. They just get so lonely when I'm at school all day. Oh, okay. Thank you! Oh no, I'm late for class. Come in. How may I help you? Um, uh... Oof. My name's Twilight Sparkle. I'm new here and... Well, I understand that Fluttershy found a crown this morning and gave it to you. Yes, I've had Vice Principal Luna put it somewhere for safekeeping. No idea how it ended up on the front lawn. Were you interested in running for Princess of the Fall Formal this year? Uh, no, not exactly. The truth is... Well, the truth is I... You see, the crown is actually... Princess of the Fall Formal? It's Canterlot High's big fall dance. Like the Grand Galloping Gala. A grand galloping gala? Oh, uh, it was a big deal at my old school. And was there a princess? Yes, but she wasn't exactly a student. Here at Canterlot High, the students select one of their peers to represent them. She receives her crown at the fall formal. Hmm. You asked me if I was interested in running for princess. Can anyone run? Yes, you just need to let the head of the fall formal planning committee know you'd like to be on the ballot. Was there anything else? Um, nope. That was it. Well, if you do need anything else, my door is always open. Twilight, why didn't you just tell her the crown was yours and ask for it back? Oh, I was going to. But imagine if one of them showed up in Equestria saying they came from a place filled with tall, fleshy, two-legged creatures with these. We'd think they were crazy. Hmm. You make a good point. Looks like if I want my crown back, I'll have to become princess of the Canterlot High Fall Formal. So that's what I'm gonna do. And how exactly do you plan on doing that? I have no idea. I know we've just met, but I was wondering if you might be able to help me with something. Of course! I've decided to run for Princess of the Fall Formal and... <gasps> oh, oh, gosh! Sorry, it's just... Oh, running for Fall Formal Princess is a really bad idea. Why? Sunset Shimmer wants to be Fall Formal Princess. And when she wants something, she gets it. She'll make life awful for anyone who stands in her way. Just ask the girl who ran against her for Princess of the Spring Fling. I have to try. Oh, I don't think you understand. You'd have to convince everyone here to vote for you instead of her. The athletes, the fashionistas, the dramas, the eco-kids, the techies, the rockers. Why is every pony... Uh, everybody separated this way. Maybe it was different at your old school, but at CHS, everybody sticks to their own kind. One thing they do have in common is that they know Sunset Shimmer is gonna rule this school until we graduate. 
Not if I can help it. So, uh, huh, where would I find the head of the party planning committee? Fluttershy said she'd probably be in here. Pinkie Pie? <gasps> Are you psychic? Uh, no. I don't think so. Unless, of course, that's something you can do here. Uh, not usually. Fluttershy said this is where I'd find the head of the Fall Formal Planning Committee. Fluttershy, huh? Don't let the whole shy thing fool you. She can be a real meanie. You two aren't friends? We did a bit to get your name on the ballot, huh? Dance is day after tomorrow. I'm brand new here. Ooh! I thought you didn't look familiar. So, now that I'm really looking at you... Do you have a twin sister who lives in the city, has a pet dog named Spike that looks just like that one? Uh, maybe? Thought so. Anywho, just need to fill this out and you are officially up for the coveted princess of the fall formal crown. Never held a pen before. <laughs> Is it? Somebody order a dozen cases of fizzy apple cider. Ooh, ooh, me, 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 me. Yeah, uh -huh, me. Can you bring in the rest? Yep. Hey, I know you. You do? Sure. You're the new girl who gave Sunset Shimmer the what for today. Twilight Sparkle here is going to run against Sunset Shimmer for Princess of the Fall Formal. I'd think twice about that. Oh, sure, she'll probably approach y'all friendly-like. <laughs> I sure am looking forward to some friendly competition. That's so good to hear. But then, here comes the backstabbing. About the only girl at this school you can trust less than Sunset Shimmer is Rainbow Dash. Rainbow Dash? <laughs> She's the captain of, like, every team at Canterlot High. She's also the captain of saying she's gonna do something for you, and then turning around and not even bothering to show up. Thanks for the advice, Applejack. But this is something I really need to do. Huh? Suit yourself. Hey, how do you know my name was Applejack? Um, I, uh, <laughs> didn't you say? Mm, nope. Well, uh, it was sure nice meeting you both. I'm sure I'll be seeing you around. That one's trying to hide a secret, but I am totally onto her. She's psychic! Uh-huh. If you say so. This looks terrible! There should be more streamers near the stage and fewer balloons. Yeah! Streamers! And fewer balloons! Fizzy apple cider? Ugh, this is my coronation, not a hoedown. Well, now, it ain't necessarily gonna be your coronation this time around. Oh, is that so? You country folk really aren't that bright. Must be why the other students say such awful things about you. <sighs> Obviously, it's gonna be my coronation. I'm running unopposed. Not this time. The new girl just signed up. What? I know. Her handwriting is really bad. Where is this Twilight Sparkle? <laughs> I'm looking forward to meeting the competition. I didn't recognize you earlier. Should've known Princess Celestia would send her prized pupil here after my crown. And her little dog, too. It's my crown. Whatever. 
This is just a minor setback for me. You don't know the first thing about this place, and I already rule it. If that's so, why do you even need my crown? You went to an awful lot of trouble to switch it with the one that belongs here. Pop quiz. What happens when you bring an element of harmony into an alternate world? You don't know? Seriously? <laughs> and you're supposed to be Princess Celestia's star student? Then again, what were the chances she'd find some pony as bright as me to take under her wing after I decided to leave Equestria? Bit embarrassing that you were the best she could do. Oh, and I keep an eye on your mutt. Hate for him to be taken away from you. Is that a threat? Oh, of course not. But I'd cut down on the chatter if I were you. Don't want everyone to know you two don't belong here. Now would you? You want to be a princess here? Please. You don't know the first thing about fitting in. I want you to follow her. Bring me something I can use just like you did with that last girl who thought she could challenge me. You got it, Sunset Shimmer. When the crown and its power are mine, Twilight Sparkle will be sorry she ever set hoof into this world. Not that she would have been much safer if she'd stayed in Equestria. <laughs> yeah, in Equestria. What are you still doing here? Go! No! Oh. Butter crackers. Voila! Sunset Shimmer is right. I don't know the first thing about this place. If I'm gonna really fit in and win votes, we need to do some research. Research? This place has a school. I have to believe it's got a library. Got your phone? Got yours? <laughs> so, I just push the letters here, and then the words and moving pictures will come up here? <sighs> That's right. Maybe this place does have magic. When you're a younger <sighs> girls, what are you doing? We're just seeing how many hits our new music video has gotten. No, just no. The school computers are for research purposes only. It's just as well, y'all. Some of the comments about our song were really awful. Epic fail. Funniest thing I've ever seen? Funniest thing they've ever seen, huh? Uh, I don't know that that's what you should take from... Closing in five minutes. <sighs> I hadn't even thought about where we're gonna sleep tonight. Way ahead of you. 
It's a little <coughs> dusty, <coughs> but it doesn't seem like anybody comes up here. It's perfect, Spike. So, how did your research go? I found this book. It's called a yearbook. It seems to be something they use to keep a record of things that have happened at the school. Look, that's Pinkie Pie, Rainbow Dash, Applejack, Fluttershy, and I'm gonna bet the girl on the far right is Rarity. There's a Rarity here? Uh, I mean, uh, interesting photo. It's interesting because they look like they're friends. They do look like our friends, but I thought we'd figure that out already. No, I mean, they look like they're friends with each other, but it doesn't seem like they're friends now. Not so much. I just can't help but get the feeling that Sunset Shimmer had something to do with it. I wouldn't put it past her. But she wanted your crown, because she's planning on doing something even worse. If you're gonna stop her, you have to focus on making friends here. Can't worry about why these girls aren't friends anymore. Even if they do remind you of your Ponyville friends. You're right, Spike. Ah, eye on the prize. Good morning, students, and happy Thursday. Just a reminder to pick up your ballots for the Princess of the Fall Formal today. They are due by the time the dance starts tomorrow night, so don't forget to turn them in and make your voice heard. Fluttershy said I'd need to win over all those different groups if I want to become Princess of the Fall Formal, so I've compiled a list of talking points. <laughs> you made a list? <laughs> That's so unlike you. <laughs> uh, please, continue. I'll start introducing myself. Sprinkle in some things I've learned about their world into the conversation. Show them how I fit in here. <sighs> okay, Spike. Time to make a good first impression on my fellow students. The whole world sort of depends on it. Hey, look. <laughs> Why is everybody looking at me funny? No! What are you... What are you... Rarity? Perfect! Oh, yes, this is good. No one will recognize you. Why wouldn't I want to be... And we'll need a disguise for your dog. Which is too bad. He really is so adorable. You know, with a little work, I think I could make him look like a rabbit instead. Hmm? A rabbit? There you are, Twilight. So much for the disguise. I've been looking all over for you. Me too. Me three! I like your new look. I do have an eye for these sorts of things. Not that you seem to care. What? Why do you think she doesn't care? <laughs> No, never mind. Why are we all looking for me? What's going on? Oh, she hasn't seen it yet. Seen what? Oh, it's really not that bad. <laughs> Twilight Sparkle wants to be your fall formal princess. But what does it say about our school if we give someone like this such an important honor? Yesterday, at the library. Has everyone in the school seen this? Is that why they were all looking at me that way? Mm. What am I gonna do? No one is gonna vote for me after seeing this. Not that it'll make any difference, but I'll still vote for you. You were so nice to stand up for me when Sunset Shimmer was picking on me yesterday. If you still wanna run, maybe there's something I can do to help. Word of advice, don't accept her help. She doesn't take anything seriously. Uh, why do you have to be so awful to me? Oh, <laughs> don't play innocent Pinkie Pie. You are no better than she is. And what is that supposed to mean? I am happy to offer up my assistance as well. To someone who would appreciate what I have to offer. Which we have to I give up. We have to offer Listen to y'all carrying on. Get over it and move on. You mean like how you've gotten over what happened with Rainbow Dash? She said she'd get the softball team to make an appearance at my bake sale. 
I tell everybody they're coming, and then not one of them shows up. She made a liar out of me. That's different. It is not. It's two. I bet you appreciate it. All of you. I want to show you something. You were friends once. The freshman fair. Y'all remember? Yes. But something happened. I think that something was Sunset Shimmer. Well, it's a nice theory, darling. But Sunset Shimmer had nothing to do with it. She's right. Sunset Shimmer isn't the one who ruined my silent auction for the animal shelter by bringing fireworks and noisemakers. It was supposed to be a serious event, and Pinkie Pie ruined it. What are you talking about? I got a text from you saying that you didn't want a silent auction. You wanted a big party. Uh, I never sent you a text. You didn't? You don't think she's the one who's been sending me those emails, do you? Every time I volunteer to help with the decorations at a school function, I get an email from Pinkie Pie saying she has plenty of volunteers. And then I find out she's done everything herself. Well, I never sent you any emails. Maybe she's the reason Rainbow Dash didn't show up for my bake sale. Didn't you ever ask Rainbow Dash why she didn't show up? <laughs> I guess I kind of stopped talking to her at all after that. Maybe now would be a good time to start. They're actually talking. That's a good sign. Somebody, and I think we can all guess who, told Rainbow Dash that my bake sale had been moved to a different day. Dash showed up with all the softball team and thought I'd canceled on her. So you're looking to dethrone Sunset Shimmer and become Princess of the Fall Formal, huh? Gotta say, I'd really love to see that happen. I'll totally help you out. All you gotta do is beat me in a game of one-on-one. -on -one. What? First to five goals wins. One zip! you were gonna pull it off there in the end. <laughs> so, what's the plan? How can I help you be princess instead of Sunset Shimmer? But I lost. Of course you lost. I'm awesome. But I'm not gonna help just anybody try and beat Sunset Shimmer. The fall formal princess should be someone with heart and determination. You proved that you got them both. Yeah! <laughs> Extra oats? Oats? Uh, scratch that. However you normally make it is fine. Oh, we've got to stop bumping into each other like this. You know me. <laughs> Always trying to make a big splash around here. Cause my drink kinda splashed. On the ground. <laughs> I'm going to go over there now. Don't even think about it. You're already trying to get a crown. Who knows what Sunset Shimmer would do if you ended up getting her ex-boyfriend, too. I'm not trying to. I don't even know. We just accidentally... Ex-boyfriend? 
Flash Sentry broke up with her a few weeks ago. I can't believe she hasn't done something awful to him yet. Maybe she's just waiting until she has the power to do something really awful. All right, girls. Dance is tomorrow night, and we still don't know how we're going to get Twilight the vote she needs to be named Princess. Right now, folks only know the Twilight from the video Sunset Shimmer posted online. We need to help them see her differently. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. I've got it! Uh, <clears throat> I mean, um, perhaps I have a solution. Now, this may be an absolutely preposterous idea, but... What if we all wore these as a sign of unity? Freshman year, they were very, very popular. A way for everybody to show their school spirit. You know, go, cancel on Wonder Girls! <clears throat> I haven't sold any in ages. I mean, the five of us are obviously very different, but deep down, we're all cancel on Wonder Girls! Sunset Shimmer is the one who divided us, Twilight Sparkle is the one who united us, and we are gonna let everyone know it! What do you think? Everyone looks just fabulous. 
fabulous? It was a great idea, Rarity. Don't know what she's smiling about. Twilight's the one that's gonna be Princess of the Fall Formal. Vice Principal Luna, something terrible has happened. Isn't this just awful? And after Pinkie Pie worked so hard to make things so perfect, why would Twilight Sparkle do something like this? Why would you think Twilight was responsible for something like this? Because I have proof. But... but I don't understand. This is clearly you in the photographs, is it not? Yes, but... I think it should be fairly obvious that the school cannot let someone who would do something like this compete for the fall formal crown. Vice Principal Luna, I found these in a trash can in the library. I thought you should see them. Someone obviously combined these photos to make it look like Twilight was the one who trashed the gym. I appreciate you bringing this to my attention, Flash. In light of this new evidence, you may, of course, continue your bid to be crowned the Princess of the Fall Formal. Thank you. You have no idea how important this is to me. <laughs> what was it gonna do? Not prove your innocence? Wouldn't be much of a Canterlot wonder cult, would I? I am afraid enough damage has been done to the gym that we will have to postpone the dance until tomorrow night. If you will excuse me, I need to let my sister know about this latest development. So, uh, I was wondering, if you aren't already going with somebody, want to go to the fall formal with me tomorrow night? That would be... tomorrow night? No, 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 I can't, the portal, that'll be too late. One no would have been fine. It's not okay. It's not okay at all. If I don't get my crown tonight, I won't be able to go back to Equestria for another 30 moons. Oh, what are we gonna do? Hmm. We tell them the truth. Let them know what's really at stake if you don't get the crown tonight. They'll help us figure something out. But what if they won't? What if when they find out just how different I really am? Twilight, these girls rallied around you because they saw what was in your heart. They aren't going to feel any differently about you when they find out you're a pony princess in Equestria. I'm glad you followed me here, Spike. Me too. Unless, of course, we get stuck here for another 30 moons. You okay? The fall formal isn't happening tonight. What? It had to be postponed because Sunset Shimmer had snips and snails ruin all of Pinkie Pie's decorations. What? But the fall formal has to happen tonight. <sighs> you see... You're from an alternate world and you're a pony princess there and the crown actually has a magical element embedded in it that helps power up other magical elements and without it they don't work anymore and you need them to help protect your magical world and if you don't get the crown tonight, you'll be stuck in this world and you won't be able to get back for like a really, really long time! <laughs> Yeah, I'm pretty sure that isn't the reason. Nope, she's pretty much spot on. He can talk! Oh, yeah. And back where I come from, I'm not even a dog. I'm a ferocious, fire-breathing dragon! This is so amazing. Tell me, what are you thinking right now? Ooh. Sure would love a scratch behind the old ears. Gah. Uh, maybe later. How did you know all that? Just a hunch. Wait a minute. Let me get this straight. You're a pony? You're a princess? You're from another world? Mm -hmm. That is awesome! Oh, well, what else is that? See? I told you. I simply cannot believe they did all this. If I only had some kind of party cannon that could decorate everything super fast. I know it seems impossible, but maybe if we all work together, 
Now that's the kind of can-do spirit I'm looking for in a fall formal princess. Let's do it, y'all! Absolute rock on! Yes, indeed! -ly. It's time for us to come together. It's the only way that things will get better. It's time for us to take a stand. So come on and land a helping hand. Fix it up. is back on for this evening. Yeah! So you better get out of here and start getting ready. Oh, and don't forget to cast your ballots for Fall Formal Princess on your way out. You got my vote, Twilight. Mine too. Mine too. Mine too. You're lucky she was able to pull this off. Next time I ask you to make a mess of things, try to show a little restraint. I need this formal to go on tonight just as much as she does. I still can't believe we pulled that off. I can. We're awesome. Enough chatter, girls. We need to get ready. We need to look fabulous. This is our big night. Twilight! Look, I know you said no about going to the fall formal with me, but would you reconsider and at least have one dance? I didn't say no. I mean, I did, but I didn't mean no to you. I was... Well, what I mean is... Yes, I'd love to dance with you. Shimmer? Maybe she was too embarrassed to show. She's got to know you won by a landslide. 
First off, I want to say how wonderful everything looks tonight. You all did a magnificent job pulling things together after the unfortunate events of earlier. And now, without further ado, I'd like to announce the winner of this year's Fall Formal Crown. The princess of this year's Fall Formal is... Oh, that is so awesome! <laughs> Twilight Sparkle! Yes! Congratulations, Twilight. Twilight! Help! Spike? Dream of it. I'm not a monster, Twilight. Let him go. You don't belong here. Give me the crown, and you can go back to Equestria tonight. Or keep it and never go home. <gasps> Tick tock, Twilight. We haven't got all night. The portal will be closing on its own in less than an hour. So, what's your answer? No. What? Equestria, your friends, lost to you forever. Don't you see what I'm about to do to the portal? Yes, but I've also seen what you've been able to do here without magic. Equestria will find a way to survive without my element of harmony. This place might not if I allow it to fall into your hands. So go ahead, destroy the portal. You are not getting this crown. Fine. You win. You are so awesome! Can't believe you were gonna do that for us. It's no wonder you're a real-life princess. Oh, yes, she's so very special. Grab him, you fool! Yeah. <laughs> Imagine. to jump through so many hoops tonight just to get my hands on this crown. And it really should have been mine all along. But let's let bygones be bygones. I am your princess now. And you will be. 
be loyal to me. When I said I was going to destroy the portal, I don't want to rule this pathetic little high school. I want Equestria. And with my own little teenage army behind me, I'm going to get it. Uh... No, you're not. Oh, please. What exactly do you think you're going to do to stop me? I have magic, and you have nothing. She has us! <laughs> Gee, the gang really is all back together again! <laughs> now step aside! Twilight has tried to interfere with my plans one too many times already! She needs to be dealt with! Sunset Chimmer, but you cannot wield it because you do not possess the most powerful magic of all, the magic of friendship. You will never rule in Equestria. Any power you may have had in this world is gone. Tonight, you've shown everyone who you really are. You've shown them what is in your heart. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't know there was another way. The magic of friendship doesn't just exist in Equestria. It's everywhere. You can seek it out. Or you can forever be alone. The choice is yours. But, but all I've ever done since being here is drive everyone apart. I don't know the first thing about friendship. I bet they can teach you. Those are my girls! Woohoo! Did that dog just talk? Whoa, weird. Seriously? The talking dog is a weird thing about all this? I, for one, think you're adorable. Oh, yeah. I believe this belongs to you. 
A true princess in any world leads not by forcing others to bow before her, but by inspiring others to stand with her. We have all seen that you are capable of just that. I hope you see it too, Princess Twilight. I do. Yeah! Would now be a completely awkward time to ask you for that dance? you? Of course we will. Although I do expect some sort of apology for last spring's debacle. I have a feeling she'll be handing out a lot of apologies. We better get going. I know we've only been friends for a short time, but I'm gonna miss all of you so much. That crown really does suit you, Princess Twilight. You know what, Spike? I am starting to feel a little more comfortable wearing it. And the wings? I've been walking on two legs and picking things up with these. Wings? I'm thrilled that's all I'll be dealing with back in Equestria. Sunset Shimmer, is she all right? I think she's going to be fine. I left her in good hands. What are hands? Where did you stay? What did they wear? Did you have fun? What'd you eat? Would you say she's just as awesome as me? <sighs> I want to tell you everything. I do. But I'm just so exhausted from all the dancing. Dancing? Oh. We've got to stop bumping into each other like this. Who's that? He's a new member of the Castle Guard. Flash Sentry, I think. Why? Do you know him? Not exactly. Ooh. Some pony's got a crush on the new guy. No, no I don't. <gasps> she does. She absolutely does. Don't be ridiculous. I don't even know him. He just totally reminds me of a guy you met in the other world who played guitar and was in a band and helped prove he didn't destroy all the decorations for a big dance so he could still run for princess of the big dance and then ask you to dance at that dance? <gasps> right? How did you know that? Just a hunch.